Welcome back to We Will Crypto, the internet's go-to podcast for all things cryptocurrency. In today's episode, we'll dive into the latest developments in the crypto market, including Bitcoin reaching new all-time highs in multiple countries, the integration of blockchain technology with artificial intelligence, major European banks entering the crypto space, and recent cybercrime activities. Bitcoin has reached new all-time highs in three countries, with its price briefly touching $31,000. The strength of Bitcoin's price continues, and analysts believe it will remain above $30,000. Traders and analysts have different views on Bitcoin's future price movement, with some anticipating further gains and others questioning the sustainability of the bullish momentum. Despite a decrease in volatility against the U.S. dollar, Bitcoin has achieved new records in Argentina, Venezuela, and Lebanon, where local currencies have been affected by inflation and macroeconomic policies. In these countries, Bitcoin has become a safe haven for individuals seeking to protect their wealth from economic uncertainties. The increasing adoption of Bitcoin in these regions demonstrates its potential as a store value and a hedge against inflation. Furthermore, in Turkey, where the lira has experienced significant depreciation, the BTC slash TRY pair has approached its previous peak from December 2021. The depreciation of the local currency has driven individuals to seek alternative investment options, leading to a surge in Bitcoin's trading volume and price appreciation. The price of Bitcoin has reached a one-year high, surpassing $31,400, driven by increasing institutional interest in cryptocurrencies. The institutional interest is evident in BlackRock's application for a Bitcoin spot ETF, indicating a growing acceptance of Bitcoin as a legitimate asset class. The potential approval of a Bitcoin ETF could attract more institutional investors and further boost the price of Bitcoin. Despite the positive price movement, there are concerns about the sustainability of the current rally. Analyst Michael Van de Pope expressed doubts about the longevity of the bullish momentum, but mentioned a potential buy zone at around 28500 if a minor correction occurs. This cautious outlook reflects the volatility and unpredictability inherent in the cryptocurrency market. Bitcoin's decentralization is also on the rise as significant holders accumulate more of the cryptocurrency, signaling a long-term commitment and boosting market confidence. This shift benefits regular users by increasing the overall stability of the Bitcoin network and reducing volatility associated with speculative trading. It also aligns with Bitcoin's ethos of decentralization, empowering individual ownership and challenging traditional financial systems. In addition to Bitcoin, other cryptocurrencies have made significant moves in the market. Robinhood customers have acquired around $1 billion worth of Dogecoin in the past month, indicating the enduring popularity of this meme-inspired cryptocurrency. Similarly, Bitcoin Cash has seen significant gains driven by increased adoption and improvement in its underlying technology. However, some analysts caution that BCH may face a potential decline in the future as the market evaluates its long-term value proposition. The recent legal actions taken by the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission against Coinbase Global Inc. and Binance Holdings LTD have cast doubts on the future of cryptocurrencies. These regulatory challenges have caused some investors to reevaluate their positions and tread cautiously in the market. However, the crypto industry remains resilient as entrepreneurs and investors shift their focus to the intersection of blockchain technology and artificial intelligence. With the introduction of OpenAI's ChatGPT bot, AI has taken center stage, captivating the attention of those who were previously fueling the crypto boom. Adam Strzok, the founder of Strzok Crypto, suggests that AI might serve as a catalyst for renewed interest in blockchain technology. The integration of blockchain and AI has the potential to enhance transparency and decentralization in AI applications, addressing concerns about data privacy and manipulation. CoinFund, a prominent investment firm, recently backed Tools for Humanity, a crypto startup exploring the intersection of blockchain and AI. Tools for Humanity developed WorldCoin, 
a digital currency and a unique ID generation system based on blockchain technology. This system provides individuals with a digital proof of personhood that combined with WorldCoin facilitates secure payments. The integration of blockchain technology can strengthen the crypto industry by improving data sorting, information security, and user experience. As the crypto industry continues to evolve, the concept of decentralized finance or DeFi has gained significant traction. DeFi protocols leverage blockchain technology to create open and permissionless financial applications that operate without intermediaries. This sector has experienced exponential growth with the total value locked in DeFi protocols surpassing $100 billion. Platforms like Compound, Aave, and Uniswap have emerged as key players, providing users with opportunities for lending, borrowing, and decentralized trading. One of the driving factors behind the DeFi boom is the concept of yield farming. Yield farming involves users lending or staking their crypto assets in DeFi protocols to earn rewards, typically in the form of additional tokens. This practice has attracted a considerable amount of liquidity to DeFi platforms as users seek to maximize their returns. However, it's important to note that yield farming carries inherent risks, including smart contract vulnerabilities and impermanent loss which require careful consideration by participants. Another notable development in the crypto space is the emergence of NFTs. NFTs are unique digital assets that represent ownership or proof of authenticity of a particular item or piece of content. These tokens have gained widespread attention for their application in digital art, collectibles, and even virtual real estate. High-profile NFT sales such as the auction of Beeple's artwork for $69 million have brought mainstream recognition to the NFT market. However, critics argue that the NFT space may be susceptible to speculative bubbles and potential copyright infringement issues. The environmental impact of cryptocurrencies, particularly Bitcoin, has also become a topic of discussion and concern. The energy consumption associated with Bitcoin mining, which relies on complex computational processes, has gained questions about its carbon footprint. In response, there's been a growing interest in alternative consensus mechanisms that are more energy efficient, such as proof of stake. Proof of stake relies on validators who hold and stake their tokens, reducing the need for intensive computational power. Governments and central banks around the world have been closely monitoring the development of cryptocurrencies and exploring the potential for central bank digital currencies, CBDCs. CBDCs are digital representations of a country's fiat currency issued and regulated by a central bank. These digital currencies aim to combine the benefit of blockchain technology such as faster transactions and increased transparency with the stability and trust associated with traditional fiat currencies. Several countries, including China, Sweden, and the Bahamas, have made significant progress in piloting or implementing CBDCs, marking a potential shift in the global financial landscape. Though others are skeptical and weary of CBDCs, as it can potentially invade individual privacy in ways never before possible. On the regulatory front, major European banks, Credit Agricole and Santander, have registered their joint subsidiary, KCS, as a digital asset service provider in France. This move allows them to enter the cryptocurrency market and offer custody services for digital assets. France has been relatively welcoming to the crypto industry, and this registration adds another traditional financial services group to the growing list of DASPs in the country. And in recent cybercrime activities, Joseph O'Connor, known as Plug Walk Joe, has just been sentenced to five years in prison for his involvement in a SIM swap attack on a cryptocurrency exchange executive. This attack allowed him to steal approximately $794,000 worth of digital assets. Another unfortunate incident involves Naum Lantzman, a 74-year-old man who lost his entire life savings of over $340,000 to a cryptocurrency scam. The lack of regulation of cryptocurrencies make them an attractive avenue for scammers and it's crucial to raise awareness to prevent others from falling victims to such scams. 
In conclusion, as the crypto industry matures, regulatory frameworks are being established to provide clarity and protection for investors. Governments are working to strike a balance between fostering innovation and safeguarding against risks such as money laundering, fraud, and market manipulation. Regulatory bodies are issuing guidelines and implementing measures to ensure compliance with existing laws and regulations. Market participants, including exchanges and service providers, are adapting to these evolving requirements to maintain transparency and legitimacy within the crypto ecosystem. The crypto landscape continues to evolve at a rapid pace. Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies have experienced significant price movements, driven by various factors such as institutional interests, macroeconomic conditions, and technological advancements. The integration of blockchain technology with AI the rise of DeFi and NFTs, sustainability concerns, and the exploration of CBDCs all contribute to the ongoing transformation of the financial industry. As the crypto market matures and regulatory frameworks are established, the industry holds the potential to reshape traditional financial systems and provides new opportunities for individuals and businesses worldwide. You included. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of We Will Crypto. Stay safe and stay informed.